Hi there. So a question that I'm often asked is what accounting software should people be using to record for their small business? Well, you started up in business to do what you love to do or to do what you're good at, not to sit there and collect a whole pile of receipts and invoices and do your bank reconciliations. So you want something that's going to really make it very simple for you to use. Now, over the last year or two, I've been testing out various different packages, um, including Sage 50, Sage Accounts, Zero, Clearbooks, Free Agent, Cashflow, etc. And Excel, of course. The three that come out on top, now, it depends on how you want to run your business, but Excel works extremely well. You know, it's so simple to use. Once you've got the 365 license, it's kind of free and there's nothing else you need to worry about. Um, but, you know, it doesn't really help to control the business. Yes, you can list your invoices, list your receipts, etc. And that's, a, that's kind of about it. Do some analysis. Now, the two that I've come down on now, really, if you don't want to be an accountant and use Sage 50, is to pick Zero or Clearbooks. They're both online versions. Clearbooks, I think, cost something like £10 a month. Um, it's great when it's all set up and working and you understand what you're doing. Or Zero, which in its full version, I think is something like £24 a month. Your best bet with that is to get somebody to set it up for you and help you to start to run it. Then you can go on from there. Now, Zero do do various different things. You can get an accountant to set you up the cash books with a pure ledger or for the whole system. Now, I have to say, after a year of using it myself for my business, then that is the option I would go for if anybody asks for me. So the free bank feed you can get from it, so it will download all your data from your bank bank account, put it straight into zero so you can just analyse the costs out. It's great if you have your own bank account for the business, though. You don't really want your mortgage or your gift to Aunt Edna to come in on that bank statement. So there you go. I've put my stake in the ground and will go for either Clearbooks or Zero or Excel if you're really desperate. Okay, thanks then. Bye.